Hello everyone. This video introduces how to use 3D Touch on MKS Robin Nano V3 motherboard. Connect the 3D Touch servo cable to the VL Touch interface of the motherboard. Probe signal cable connected to ZMAX and stop interface. Remove the Z-axis and stop. Connect the 3D Touch servo cable to the VL Touch interface of the motherboard. The probe signal line connected to Z-min and stop interface. There are two situations for the configuration of Zeman probe pin. When Z-safe homing is not in use, disable Zeman probe uses Zeman and stop pin. Enable Zeman probe pin and change the pin to PC4. Zmax and stop invertering is set to false. When using Z-safe homing, disable Zeman probe pin. Enable Zeman probe uses Zeman and stop pin. Zeman and stop invertering is set to false. Enable Z-safe homing. Use Z-safe homing or not. The following configuration is the same. Enable BL touch. Set the X, Y, and Z offsets. And set them according to the measured values. The initial value of Z offset can be set to 2. And then calibrate it after leveling. Set the distance between the probe and the boundary. Set Z probe low point. The initial value can be set to 3. Enable auto bed leveling linear. Set the number of leveling points. Enable EEPROM settings. Enable Z probe end script and set the command to save the leveling data after leveling. Enable the servos. Set the number of servos to 1. Add setbed leveling enable true in the g28.cpp file. Compile the firmware. This shows that the firmware has been compiled successfully. Copy the compiled firmware file and assets folder to the root directory of the SD card or USB disk and insert it to the motherboard for update firmware. Now for automatic leveling. Adjust Z offset after leveling. 
Move the Z-axis to keep the distance between the extruder head and the platform with the thickness of a sheet of a 4 paper. After adjusting Z-offset, click Save. 